Once again, my dog is wound up. We've been hard at it all day today. He ain't got much playtime in. And he's, he's being a handful. Rambunctious as always. Telling you, he's work. He's work all the time. This morning, I did get him out for a little while, you know. Hey, hey, hey. No, no, no. No, sir. No, sir. No digging allowed. Thank you. Woo, Sam got you. You got ants in your face now? Probably. When you gonna learn? Hey, hey, again. This is a PG show. Yeah, PG. Flip her up right, bear boy. Hey. Hey, that's enough. What are we doing? All right, nothing like a little, little rolling around. Sometimes I feel like that. Sometimes I feel like just, you know, flopping on the ground. Rolling around. Yeah. Looks like it could be fun. Kind of wished I had that dog's life, I'm telling you. He's a mess. He is a mess. Where are you going? Hey, let's get back up this way. Hey. Here. Come here, why don't you do something for me? Do you think you can do something? Huh? Sit. Say, bang, dead dog. Dead. Well, ain't that a dead dog? That's a fabulous dead dog. Sarge, fabulous, fabulous. Let's, let's get up close and personal with those Sargey. Good. Hey, no trash. What did I tell you about that trash eating? No, sir. Well, anyway, that's one of his one of his tricks. He does many. We'll get him doing that here pretty soon. You know, if you like that kind of stuff, we'll get him playing around with, with some things. Well, now ain't he just a happy little fella with that stick? <laughs> oh, my, my, my. You happy with about that? You just so happy. Yeah. He's a good dude. He is a good dude. Well, looks like he's going to stay over there playing with it. I guess he's being camera shy. Oh, no, here he comes. Here he comes. All right, got a drive by. You doing do a drive by? All right then. Well, anyway, I hope everybody's had a spectacular, awesome day. I sure do. You know, our day was 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 nice, busy, had fun out there. You know, running around, see some unusual characters out on the roads. I sure did. It's just mind blowing at times what I see. But uh. <laughs> I got a distraction. You know that happens with me. I get to looking around and next thing you know I spot something. But uh I just have to make sure it's not anything that old Sargy here, you know, might wanna get defensive over. I guess you'd say he's always he's very protective of me. Great dog, but he is very protective with me. He doesn't really want anything coming at me. So I have to keep an eye on things. And uh Make sure he stays out of trouble. Keeps me out of trouble. You know what I mean? Yeah, at least I don't want no trouble. Nah. But, what was we talking about? Oh, the, the characters out on the road. I'm telling you, you could see some things. You, I seen a man change your clothes today. Sure did. He took him down the road. He's unbuckling his breeches and stepped down, down and pulled his shirt off. Going down Interstate 35 now. I'm watching this. I was wondering why he was going all over the road. I thought maybe he was just sleepy. You know, and the speed limit would drop down to 35, and then we'd go back to 60, and then he, 30, finally. I was like, you know, I think I better pass him. Because, uh, we love her getting to a wreck with him or something. Anyway, got around him, or up beside him, you know, as I'm going around. He ended up changing his clothes. Who does this? No, and then men want to talk about women going down the road trying to put their lipstick on or, or doing eyelashes or whatever. No, this dude was changing clothes. What the heck? That's some, that's that's crazy. I just even I, I couldn't even wrap my head around it. Now, granted, me and old Sarge, we, I was laughing. I was laughing so hard, old Sarge didn't know what to do. He's running back and forth, back and forth, back and forth in the truck. <laughs> You can't make this stuff up, man. You can't make it up. It, it's, it was awesome. But anyway, I guess we're fixing to call it a night and let me get back to playing with him. You know, get some of his energy levels down. Because you know there's nothing worse than having a blue healer that's 
that you don't get wore down. That's what gets them in trouble. They get to chewing up things or, or just being mis mischievous, you know. That's why most people that have these healers, you know, they get started nicknaming them, you know, T-Rexes. And Lord knows I sure got a T-Rex. You hear me? Anyway, y'all have a wonderful evening. And uh, may your tomorrows be blessed. Talk to you later. Bye. What do you think about it, Sarge? Hey, that's enough. We don't eat sticks. <laughs>